Hey everyone, welcome to this, your next installment of the Golden Gate Tech Talk series. This is your source for informative and timely tech topics about Golden Gate software, data replication, and cloud data integration. The industry leading data replication software for more than 20 years, Golden Gate is still innovating today and helping thousands of leading brands get the most business value out of their data. As a multi-cloud capable replication engine, Golden Gate helps customers maintain seamless integration across their public clouds. But what makes Golden Gate really special is the breadth and attention to enterprise class solutions for databases, cloud, big data, NoSQL, and streaming technologies of all kinds, not just Oracle. Golden Gate's rock solid foundation is the best in class for data high availability, high speed transaction replication, and data warehouse loading. But modern data challenges require the most innovative solutions, and Golden Gate delivers on world-class data lake ingestion, stream data processing for real-time ETL, and advanced stream analytics that include geofencing, time series processing, and machine learning integrations. As a platform for modern data integration, Golden Gate just can't be beat. Well, that's about it for the intro. Let's get on with today's tech topic. We're talking about database migration to the cloud today. Many enterprises are shifting their database workloads to the Oracle Cloud as there are various benefits from autonomous database management and security to performance, auto-scaling, and also cost benefits. However, the big question remains, how can I move my existing databases into the cloud? Database migration has multiple unique challenges. First, there is the time. Many migration projects we have seen take six to eight months, which includes getting the right team together, often using specialists and consultants, getting the necessary hardware and infrastructure set up, as well as other plans. You're dealing with a lot of complexity. You need to choose the right tools. And if you have to do an online migration to avoid downtime, you need to set up a complex orchestration of these different tools. You also have governance challenges. How do you make sure you moved all the data? Did you meet all the SLAs you have set? Is your data secure all the way through the migration? All of this has to be made sure. And finally, performance. How can you estimate how long the migration is going to take? What capacity do you need? And how do you size the system you have to provision? All of this becomes a huge challenge. Oracle covers different approaches to database migration based on the user persona. Different user roles have vastly different expectations of database migrations. An operations user might look for a solution that is integrated to a larger enterprise management infrastructure, where typical EM processes control and monitor the migration. For these users, Oracle Enterprise Manager offers migration mechanisms to tie into database utilities. A database administrator will be comfortable with command line utilities that offer fine-grained control and customizations and orchestrate co complex databases. These users can utilize our Zero Downtime Migration, or ZDM, and MV to ADB utilities. A database and SQL developer will often work on migrations of database in development, often with deep changes and conversions to the database schema. These users can utilize data conversion and migration functionality in Oracle SQL Developer. And finally, a new breed of database users is emerging in line of business organizations. This so-called shadow IT or citizen integrator is looking for autonomous capabilities that automate complex database operations. And these users enjoy the new autonomous database offerings. For these users, we are, de for these users, we are developing a new native cloud service called the Database Migration Service. Let's talk about the next generation database migration service. It will provide you with a fully managed way to initiate and perform database migration from on-premise or legacy or third-party clouds into the Oracle cloud infrastructure. You just have to create a migration project and then press one single button to create the migration. It will open a guided experience where you select your source and target databases and you don't have to worry about the underlying system resources. This is all automatically managed by the service. You just provide information about your source and target, such as connectivity and which schemas and objects you would like to move. The system will perform a pre-migration validation to make sure that all preconditions for the migration are met, such as connectivity and required settings. After that, you can initiate the migration. It will start with an initial load that copies a snapshot of the current database 
onto the target. Meanwhile, it will capture all ongoing transactions so that you can keep source trend applications online for the duration of the migration. After the initial load, it will continue to replicate all changes to the source until you complete the migration so that you can cut over your application from the source to the target database. And by doing this, you are live with your database in the cloud. You have seen that there are solutions for database migration at Oracle that covers all user personas. Please visit our webpage to find out more. Hey everyone, thanks again for tuning in to this edition of the Golden Gate Tech Talk series. Be sure to check out all the other cool tech talks that are out there and stay tuned for more as they become available.